I absolutely love it. Um, I've actually had the opportunity, when we go in to do the Messages Project, there are donated books, brand new books lying out on a table, and you get to choose the book that you want to send. And I've actually had the opportunity to find books that I read to my daughter, my grandbaby's mother, when she was young, some of her favorite books, and then read those. And I always get emotional when I do it. <laughs> but I've had the opportunity to read those uh, to my grandbabies. So my daughter actually sent me a picture of him up on his knees on the bed watching me on the TV and he's holding the book and watching me on his knees and he's just so into it and the fact that this is offered to us at no charge and it's offered to our families at no charge you know my daughter or whoever the guardians are of these children they don't have to pay to receive these uh, it is an absolutely wonderful opportunity. It's such a blessing. And it has developed over time and over uh, these past years into an amazing uh, prototype of what could happen when women stay connected to their children. The power of connection, the power of family, the power of unity, and giving that gift absolutely free has been one of the most amazing things that has happened for women across this state. I was really excited to hear that we were able to record a message for our children. So even if they are not able to see me, they can always go back to the video for encouragement. Hi, Zaylin. Okay, you ready for another story? Just being able to see us physically on the DVD and seeing that we're okay and we're um, we're. We're not doing bad, we're, um, we're thriving, we're getting better, we're not our old self, we're doing better. They can see that. So just a video of being able to see it, just, it, it helps them. Um, I can actually see, see my mom and I can actually, and it feels like I'm actually with her and that I can see her and that she's actually talking to me in person. And the idea of hearing and seeing mom's voice uh, is so encouraging. You know, prison can be a scary thing to family. And as you know, when moms go to prison, it's not just mothers that go, but children that are really, truly collateral damage, that don't really understand, don't really get it. And the worry over mom's not back home, she's not coming home, and then to get a package that's so comforting that says, baby, I'm okay. I love you and this has nothing to do with you. As a matter of fact, we're gonna read a story together. That's amazing. And I always do the silly voices and everything and just make it feel like I'm, try to make it feel like I'm right there with him. I sing this certain song to him. And so when I sing it to him, um, now he knows it, he's three years old. And so now when I see him, he knows me. And, so, and it all began with the song that he was able to see my face. Why do birds suddenly appear? Every time you are near, just like me, they want to be close to you. <laughs> and it, it kept us connected almost like I never left in a way. So they, when they come to visit me, it doesn't seem like it's been such a big time lapse because I was able to send those messages to them and they were able to see my face. I would say, please get, um, do the video, get your kids, get your books, even if they're older, get a book, get a journal, because even journaling is really good for the kids. Um, it, it does benefit you and it does benefit the kids and I encourage it highly. I, I think you have no idea what a blessing it is and just the closeness you feel and the child feels. I, I just think it helps them emotionally, physically even, it makes them just feel closer. It's, it's like a hug. And that's what OK Messages Project does. It brings families closer together.